Hello Wolf Den, my name is Voltanilda and welcome back to Shopper Keep. And the music apparently stopped, so yay! Let's see, um, there was an update so stuff changed a bit, we have a new lookout like this and let's see. Anything new? Don't, don't be scared of the headless hovering eyes. Slow and save any file by pressing the end button right if you have any shops saved and check out your customer base. Yeah, I can see how that can look creepy. <laughs> okay. Um, my shop. Low FPS. Try checking if your machine uses dual G uh, GPUs. Might be using the lower end one. Uh, I think I'm only using one and it's a uh, 970, I think. Not sure. Not sure at all. I missed the music. Yes, I know. Okay. Does this mean you're loading? Or... Yes? I think it's loading. Yes! It's loading? Um... Um... We look dashing. Look at that moustache of ours. Hmm. And the monocle. Yes. What the hell happened to our shop? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Um, in the back room of your shop, that is useful. Because if I do, nothing happens there. I think I might have made a very big mistake in the last episode. A very big mistake. Um, there is all kinds of stuff that I have no idea about. Fancy painting. Uh, that was a personal chest. This was, The wand was not something we're gonna use. Oh, yep. There. <laughs> the place where we placed the skeletons last time is right over there. Which is our home, apparently. Yeah. That is genius, isn't it? Okay. Let's see. Um, I totally can't remember how to... Ah, there we go. I was wondering how to how the heck do I get there? Okay, we're gonna buy a few of these, place the order, and we are gonna open the shop. And while we wait for the order of potions to arrive, so we can fill our cabinets, who's to say no one can hope to enter our place and buy some stuff? Because we need to make money. Yup, <laughs> that is our home. That is pretty awesome that they place that right in view. So we have we have more buildings and we have an arrow. Mm. My icon is gone. Oh, uh, first thing of the day: is there any trash? Is there any trash? Because people leave stuff behind, and they would be silly to leave stuff behind. I don't think anyone left something behind. Oh, uh, that's a shame. Now we have no trash to sift through. What was the final one? Nothing. Good morning, Marianne Potter the warrior. Well, it surely is a lovely day, that's for sure. Now, let's get these potions out from the back room. And... Thank you. Let's, let's place them all over here. Uh, filled cabinets, although that one is pretty empty. Eh. People shouldn't care too much about that. Um, I already opened them for the day. What happens if I press it again? Nothing happens. Okay. 
Good to know. Um, might be a bad idea to just keep this sword in hand. I think this sword is much better. Don't you dare steal anything. If you steal anything... Thank you! If anyone steals anything, he's gonna get blasted by magics. True magics. So how much do we sell this for? For 16. So profit of 6, not too much, but if we place it too high, you get the issue of, hey, let's buy a potion. What the? How much? Yep, yeah, no, goodbye. And people want to steal your stuff. And uh, can we jump? Stay on the ground, young man. Nope, we cannot jump. I want to jump. <laughs> Jumping is a passion. Okay, so what are the daily thingies? Uh, hot items for warriors, dragon bone helm, uh, beads. Yeah, we don't have mages, we don't have rogues, and we don't have druids just yet. Ooh, someone bought a weapon. Thank you! Thank you very much. We need new weapons. There we go. Two new swords. There, yeah, whoa, what did... I just moved the entire screen. Perfect. Yeah. Can I? There we go. I just I looked up and my mouse starts to go into the the top bar of the window. I play in windowed mode. And yeah, that uh, when I clicked, it did not go well. Greetings, welcome to Shopkeep for Falcornella. Would you like to buy a potion? You have a good day too, thank you. I really like this game. What the f I don't like it when they do that though. I take quite some pride in my weapons. And we even have it on the door, no, no lo loitering. Well, that, there's no, no messing around with stuff, but... Eh, details, details. There we go. It's still early in the morning, so we should place an order for health potions. And we should clean up the floor. Can I sweep? Thank you. Perfect. So what about the trash cans? There we go. And nothing. Why don't they leave any good stuff behind? And also stuff that people would want to buy. Although, to be fair, it is seen as trash. Um, probably only the greatest adventurers would like to buy trash. Nope, not here. I keep thinking it's right over there. It's over here. With nothing in it. Thank you. Ooh, people entering my shop. Yes, people entering my shop. Um, thank you. L look for leather boots. Sorry, we don't have any leather boots as of right now, but maybe in the future. Maybe in the future. Let me take my potions. Because everyone starts out as a potion seller. Perfect. I should fill that one up with potions too. Yeah, I should do that. Give me 19 of them. No one gonna buy my stuff? I got delicious health potions and also very, very sharp plain swords. Yes, you like a sword, do you? Yes, you seem to be an amazing fan of swords. I have two for sale right now that are of the most quantity you've ever seen you will certainly like the swords if you hurt yourself you... no wait that's the other way around you need a health potion if you hurt yourself with a sword come back for a sword tomorrow that did not go according to plan that did not go according to plan but we made profit so that's good <laughs> oh i love it i love it there we go. Yes. 
Okay, can we do this? Perfect! Oh, and a sword, and a sword, and a sword. And cleaning! Life of a shopkeeper is not easy. Definitely not easy. <sighs> but fun. Definitely fun. Now I wonder, what is the next step for our shop? I mean, we have the potions. Oh, hey. Oh, yes. I can play potions there too. We do not have coconut drinks. And if anyone is a filthy peasant, it is you, sir. Can I? Thank you. I place all these potions very neatly on the shelves and you just throw them over and everything and just make a general mess of my store. Sort of barbic Oh, what the... Okay. <laughs> Difficult names. Yes, do you like potion? This is way too expensive. It is not expensive. Everyone is buying except you. My shop's turning into... What? I'm not ridiculous. How do you dare call me ridiculous? It is not expensive. I have to make a profit too. Um, talking about that profits and all the stuff that's getting thrown around. You seem like a good mate. Thank you. You seem like a good mate too, unlike others. You have a good day too. Need to. Fix all the stuff. Thank you. And whoop. Lovely. Okay, so we have enough potions. Really? Really? This can't be good. If I could zap you without any repercussions, without me losing Thank you! You're a good person, unlike the others. Seriously, give me some time to place the stuff back on the counter before you throw the next item away. What did I just say? Really, really, really? Uh, it's the fact that it loses me money. There we go. Everybody likes shopping. Um, yeah, we need new swords. The sort of making us the most money, definitely. So, five new swords, that should do. Uh, you are not in the right position, are you? We're selling lots of stuff. I love it. I love it. I don't love you. Did you? Did you? No, he just threw it over. Okay, good. I would have sapped him. Okay, the game is ever so slightly unresponsive when it comes to placing down items and picking them up. But that is okay. Okay. A new order in the back room. Give me my swords. Give me my swords. Because people like swords. And when people hurt themselves with my swords, they will need the health potions. It's a win-win situation. For me, not for them. Definitely for me. Definitely for me. <laughs> so, would you like to buy a sword? <laughs> you will not be taking that. Have a good day. <laughs> Filthy peasant. Filthy peasant. Think you can steal from an old adventurer who took an arrow to the knee and went into the shopping business. Yes, I just made the joke. Not the way it was supposed to be made. Really? I can see it. Think you can hide my sword with your magic tricks, huh? Yeah, come on. There we Thank you. And of course, you made a big mess of my store. <sighs> Sad. 
silly, silly thieves. What do they think they can achieve? Oh, I stole one health potion, or I stole one sword, and I'm gonna regret it with my life. Because I died. It is not smart. Really, not smart. But do we have anything that people threw away that is still of a very nice value? I don't think we have anything. Anything? Leather boots! We got leather boots! Yay! I like leather boots. Also, I like the smell of leather. Uh, oh, we can place them over here. Oh, sweet. Nice. And for how much do we sell them? 70. That's good enough. But yeah, the smell of leather. I got a friend who does all kinds of leather businesses. He makes pouches and belts and who knows what emblems. It is really amazing what he does. And leather just has a certain kind of smell once it's treated. And it smells awesome. Bit weird maybe, but still awesome. They really don't look like leather boots, do they? Well, maybe a tiny bit, but... Eh. Can't complain. Can't complain. We need a mirror over here. We definitely need a mirror over here. Ah, evening time is coming. Not too many people are gonna buy stuff. You can be happy I didn't blast you. Can I take my sword? Thank you. I really would like to blast people away. It's like... Or... Looky here, people, looky here. We have Fontanelle Shopper. And we have amazing stuff. We have a light... Sh we have a light show. You should definitely come looking. We have a perfect light show. And I am messing stuff up. Light show. You love it. See? Yes, you... Well, you have a good evening too. It is technically evening, so... We have a lot of building to do. Have a good day. Thank you, you too. I was gonna say, you are dirtying my floor and then you... No, you don't! Those are my leather boots. I found them fair and square. Don't steal my leather boots. Because I don't like it when you do that. Definitely don't like it when you do that. So, is there any new trash anywhere? Maybe? Somewhere? Yes, there is. How about those other two trash cans? There must be goodies. There must be goodies. Come on. Show me the good stuff. Uh, that is not good stuff. That is just whole air. Warmed up by the sun. Okay, let's clean this up because we do not want to scare any customers away. We always want to scare thieves away. And apparently... Our previous Halloween decorations got removed. Oh well. Walking through door skills. I love it. <laughs> dirty floor, dirty floor, dirty floor. Nobody likes a dirty floor. Okay, we have two swords left and one pair of leather boots. The boots are gonna go over here. Um, quite a few potions left, so we're good on that front too. Now, what else can we build? Holds only one small item. Oh, they placed that! Holds 12 small items excluding armor and, we and weapons. Nice. One medium item. With the counter, we basically have two medium items. 
Um, Hatch Rack not unlocked. We have a counter. Armor Rack not unlocked. Bot Dock. Weapon Rack holds two medium weapon items. Interesting. Also, I need to... What happens if I do this? Okay. There's something I noticed. People were walking straight through. My shelf. Can I come on somewhere over here? No! There we go. Thank you. Because now you can't walk straight through here. You get stuck. Same over here. You can't go through. Well, people were walking st straight through that one too. I don't know. Give me my potions. Thank you. And... Yeah, somewhere over here. Perfect. <laughs> okay, let's restock the shelves with potions. And... Yep, perfect. All in one. Okay. Now, what would we like to build? Also, how many K points do we have? Or whatever it's called. 38. That's not a lot. We don't have entry fee. Uh, Anti-haggle is also not going to work. The portal is not worth it in my opinion. We are also way too far away from those. Um, makes thieves steal less. Maybe. A floor mats way too expensive. Armor and hat rack. Interesting. The final player. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Engineering. Popular. Uh, we want to be popular. We want to be popular. It's far out of our reach, though. Same with this stuff. Um. Yeah, this is also pretty far out of our reach. Definitely. I think we're just gonna stick to a weapon rack. If we can place them, why can't I place the? Oh, is that because the door opens in that direction? That might very well be the case. Okay, this costs one hundred each. That is expensive. But. They could make us money. Well, I don't want you that close. Can I? And almost. Ah. Perfect. Hey, <laughs> that's some extra room for more swords. I love it. And it's a bit out of the way though, but so it leaves an area for me to walk through. It's getting more difficult to make money. It definitely gets more difficult to make money. Hmm. I could buy two more racks. I think I'm gonna do that. I think we're gonna focus on a lot of weapon business. Uh, let's see, you were over here. Um. Yeah, we just place you over here, and your friend goes right over there. Perfect. We don't have the swords for those, but we will get them soon. We will definitely get them soon. But, this will be the end of today's episode of Shopaki. So, if you liked it, feel free to leave a like, comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to stay up to date with all my daily uploads. Have a very nice day, and I'll see you all in the next episode of Shopper Keep. And remember, have fun.